So guys, I've been seeing so many good looking recipes on Instagram Reels. <laughs> and I've become inspired. I've been seeing this salmon and spinach wellington, also known as a adult hot pocket. <laughs> I've been seeing it all over social media, so I wanted to give it a try. Here in this skillet, I have a little, the reason why the oil's red is because I'm using chili oil, because I'm making it spicy, so you can just use regular olive oil. I'm gonna go ahead and saute some onions and some olive oil. Now once my onions start to get nice and soft, I'm gonna go ahead and add in a little bit of red bell pepper. I'm gonna let that saute up for about another minute or so. Next, I'm gonna add in some frozen spinach that I thawed and then I used a paper towel to squeeze out all that extra liquid. You want it nice and dry because you don't want your mixture to be runny. And then I'm gonna add in some minced garlic. And I'm gonna let this saute together for a couple of minutes. I'm also gonna season this, so. Now for seasonings, I'm adding in some garlic powder, onion powder, salt, pepper, and some red pepper flakes. And we're just gonna let this cook for a couple of minutes, and then we're gonna set it aside to cool. Now here in the bowl, I have some room temp cream cheese. You wanna make sure your cream cheese is nice and soft so you can mix in that spinach with it. It'll be a little bit difficult if your cream cheese is cold and stiff. <laughs> so here I'm just gonna go ahead and add in that spinach to that bowl of cream cheese. And then I'm gonna throw in some Parmesan cheese. And then we're just gonna mix this well. I started off with this rubber spatula, nah. I had to switch to a spoon, girl. <laughs> but you just wanna make sure it's mixed well. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and season my salmon. I'm using a little bit of this red garlic seasoning. I love this stuff. And then I'm gonna hit it with some Old Bay. I seasoned both sides of the salmon. I also added some pepper and some salt. So here I have my puff pastry sheet and I'm gonna go ahead and add a big dollop of the cream cheese spinach mixture to one side of it. I did roll out my puff pastry just a little bit with some flour in my rolling pin. Next, I went ahead and placed the salmon on top, and then I'm gonna go ahead and close it up. Now me, I wanted to make it nice and neat, so that's all I'm doing is I'm trying to make the edges nice and neat. Now once you have it, now once it's nice and closed up, we're gonna go ahead and add an egg wash to the top. That's gonna give it that golden brown, sun-kissed look. Nice and shiny. And then I'm gonna cut a couple of slits in the top. And then we're gonna pop this in the oven. And once it's done, she is a beaut. I did leave it in the oven a little bit too long. But yeah, like I said, this recipe I've been seeing all over social media and I wanted to give it a try. And I'm so glad I did. You should give it a try too. Yum.